Hello, welcome to another video with me. So today I just wanted to talk about something really interesting and I feel like everyone can relate to it in some sense. Um, right now it's really cloudy outside and I think it's about to rain, that's why the lighting is so good. Um, and I like this I like this kind of weather. I like it because um, I can stay indoors and I don't have to go anywhere or get wet. I actually like the rain, but um, it's nice to stay indoors and kind of, I guess, cozy up with a good book or coffee or something. Um, I actually don't have coffee in here, but um, just kind of stay warm and yeah, it's a nice reflective time. It's uh, right before, um, I guess, the busyness of the holiday season. Um, Christmas is coming up in a month. Advent is coming up uh, in less than a week. So a lot of things are happening. Um, and I kind of like to see it as um, this time of year as, I mean, everyone says it's the most wonderful time of the year. It's everything's happening. It's everyone's so happy. Everyone's so joyful. Um, magic is in the air as the movies say about Christmas um, but I really think that there this is a really special time of the year it's um, a lot of reflection can happen a lot of um, uh, gratefulness we've just celebrated Thanksgiving recently so a lot of Thanksgiving and gratitude and appreciation for all that um, we have we do have in our lives um, all that um, we can be grateful for. Um, and I have this mug here. It doesn't have coffee in it. It just has some tissue paper to make it not dusty. Um, this mug, uh, I actually just recently um, thought about it. I've had this mug for almost two years now. My very dear sister got it for me for Christmas uh, about two years ago. And um, I really like it. It's uh, just a simple mug, but it's uh, it says, the best is yet to come. So that's what it says on here, and it's just blank. Um, but I always, when I receive it for Christmas, I like mugs, and um, I like this mug especially because my my really um, dear sister got it for me, but also because I like the way what it says, the best is yet to come, because I think we're always looking for um, something in our lives that will like happen, that will be amazing, and that will give us um, something to look forward to and be happy, and um, just make everything so much better and greater, which I think is true. I think that's good, um, but I think it might may lead us to disappointment because we're always focused on like something that will lead us there and something that will give us this um, uh, deep fulfillment. And um, I think at the time um, I was looking for that in my own life, I feel like uh, this quote and this mug really like kind of made me more aware of like, wow, like I'm really maybe thinking of something too much that will lead me to this fulfillment um, and uh, lead me somewhere that I really want to be, but maybe I'm focusing too much on that thing that maybe isn't the thing that I should be focusing on that will get me to that. Um, I think as humans we do this a lot as people. I think it's part of human nature, it's just part of, you know, how we work. We're always looking for something that will fulfill us. Um, and looking back at this mug now, since I've had it for almost two years and I feel like I've grown a lot in the past two years I see it a little bit differently I don't see this as one big thing that I'm waiting for it to happen or I'm seeking so much for whatever that is um, and that can be anything for anybody um, different things or whatever um, I feel like now this mug the best is yet to come more has to do with everyday living like the best is always there we just have to really seek see it I mean, maybe it's just there we just haven't that we, it's there but we haven't found it yet or maybe we have to look at it in a certain way or our, our perspective has to be different um, and I really felt like that kind of just came to me recently as of like today um, and it got me thinking like wow like maybe there isn't just this one thing that you know everyone's looking for that's it and then like that's how you find fulfillment I don't think that's true um, and I've learned that the hard way um, and yeah, so this mug I think is really cool because, well, uh, actually I haven't really used it as a mug, so actually it's been like sitting. Um, I have this little like uh, Arabic design um, to place on it. Um, 
I think it's too special to use. I don't know. Maybe I'll change my mind later about it because I just have green tissue paper in it. But um, anyways, I feel like this is relevant to me now in a different way because, um, yeah, like I've had to think about how like things are still really rich and things are still really important and beautiful um, and like um, very um, still fulfilled. Um, there is fulfillment, but maybe it's not the way I thought it would be. And I feel like that's how life is. Like every day might be like a different thing. It might be the way you see it could be different um, and it would, it would give you that fulfillment, but it's just, you have to look at it differently. Um, and I feel like there's always something that's the best yet to come and it could be something you don't even know or don't even think that way, but it's just the way that you view it. Um, I see it's my own life as of now. Um, I have a break in between my classes as of today for today and um, I don't always look forward to that because it's kind of annoying to go to class and then have a break and then go to class again. But I'm like, you know what? It's my attitude. I can make it any way I want it to. The best is yet to come in the way that I think about it. Um, even I've had to do homework for this night class that I don't want to do because I'm really like over homework and over writing assignments and just busy work. I'm done with that. I'm just tired of it. But I'm like, no, like I can still learn something from it. I can still enjoy it enough, maybe, even if I have to do it, I don't want to do it. So I'm like, even the little things of every day, even small things, I can still, I can still, um, have a good attitude of the best is yet to come, and it might surprise me. It might be something totally different than I ever thought it would be. Um, and I feel like that's a good reminder for us each and every day, um, as we progress into a new season, the, two, the new liturgical year, if you're Catholic, um, you celebrate Advent, um, a new year, like, a Gregorian, in the Gregorian calendar, um, is happening pretty soon and Christmas season like there's a lot of things happening as of uh, this time of year um, so it's not just the best yet to come with Christmas and with you know winter and New Year and whatever there's a lot of other things that look uh, you know sh we should look forward to as well just in our daily lives if this is the if <laughs> if we are willing to see it and if we're willing to maybe change our perspective a little bit and if we're willing to I guess appreciate what's in right in front of us. So anyways, that's all I want to say about this mug that my sister got from me, my dear sister. And I love it a lot. Um, and yeah, I think it's a great uh, quote and really special to me. And I hope you also found it of value as well. So as I pretend to drink from my green tea mug, <laughs> um, I say goodbye and have a nice I guess rainy day as it's starting to rain outside soon and yeah talk to you later all right bye